It's interesting to me because when they happen, I cannot breathe in. Um, and, you know, immediately a little bit of panic sets in. But if I can control that panic, then they soon go away. Yeah, it's mainly in that I cannot breathe in. The thing for me is that I will um, try and relax, you know, mentally relax, and then just hold my breath for a minute. And that's my, that's my learn, that's my relaxes in my throat, and I can slowly exhale. But I understand the, the feeling. I mean, you're, you're panic for a minute, and scared and you get worried, and then I have to take my mind and force it to relax, and then everything is all right. Try not to panic. I know that they are scary, especially when you first start having them, but try not to panic, and just try and control your mind Go to another place if you have to, you know, take your mind and go, go to the beach or go to the mountains and try and realize, and it will be all right. Uh, they happen when I drink cold water or anything cold. Um, Although I have been able to control those a little bit more by holding the liquid or the water in my mouth and letting it warm up a little before I swallow. And they also happen often when I'm angry or, or upset. Um, when I am emotional, I cannot get any air in, and it's even hard to get the air out. Um, and then they sometimes happen um, when I choke on something. That choking will cause me to spasm and, and tighten up. And that's mainly when they happen.